before installing the new post processors for Aspire or VCAR Pro, you must first find what version you are running. Open your Vetrix software, go into the Help tab and select the About option. You will see here that I'm running version 9.5. Using your web browser, navigate to www.maso.com.au. Select Documentation, go to CAM Post Processes, and click the arrow to expand. Click on Vetric VCARV and Vetric Aspire. Download the post processor that suits the version you are running. In my case, I'll download version 9.5. Double click on the file you downloaded to open the file and copy the two files inside. Open VCARV or Aspire and click File. Open Application Data folder and copy the new post processors into either the post P or the my underscore post P folder. If you copy one or more post processors into the my underscore post P folder, they become the only post processors you will see when you open VCARV or Aspire. This is a nice way of tidying up the post processor list. If you leave the my underscore post p folder empty and put them into the post p folder, they will become one of many post processors available for selection from within your Vetrix software. You now need to restart your Vetrix software to see the new post processors. For Photo VCAR, there is only one version of the post processor available. Download the post processor file and double click to open and copy the two files inside. Navigate to the C drive, double click Program Files in brackets x86 folder, double click the Photo VCAR folder, double click the Post P folder and paste the new post processor files into it. Open Photo VCAV and you will see your new post processors are available. For Cut3D there is again only one version of the post processor available. Download the post processor file and double click to open. Copy the two files inside. Navigate to the C drive Double click the program files in brackets x86 folder. Double click the cut3d folder. Double click the post p folder and paste the new post processor files into it. Open cut3d and you will see your new post processors are available.